Good evening. My name is Lauren Whitkin. Many of you know me as Temple Guy. I hope that my message this evening finds you and your family healthy and safe. As you can see, I'm speaking to you from my living room in Valencia tonight. However, I didn't originally plan on being here. I plan on being with you tonight at our home VOS for our annual honoree gala, This Magic Moment. I looked forward to celebrating with our honorees, Ruth Hurwitz, Bob Zonshein, Lori Goldie, and Asher Mayer. I know each of them personally, and I can tell you what incredible people each and every one of them is, and I can vouch for the tireless and selfless commitment that they make to our VOS community and Judaism at large. They are so worthy of our recognition. Now tonight's event, it wasn't only a celebration of our four honorees, but it was an evening for us to be together and to raise very needed funds so that we can continue what we do best at VOS. You may or may not know, but it is one of the most important fundraising events of the year for us. The funds raised through our live and silent auctions help VOS continue the important work of our synagogue. During this pandemic, I know that you all agree that VOS isn't just a want, it has been a need. The chaplain's Friday night candle lighting from our home, the rabbi's video messages. In the Whitkin home, they aren't just luxuries, they are and they were necessities. I think back to Passover and I think back to the virtual Passover Seder. With over 816 households, not people, but 816 households live streaming that night. It brought Seder to many, many Jews, not just congregants. It wasn't an extravagance, it was an essential. Without it, many of our friends, our family, and our congregants would not have had Seder at all. Even our dear friends who aren't even Jewish, but they wanted a connection to the outside world, they reached out. For the past 11 years, VOA has been with me and with my family during the good times and the bad. At times, I've needed them and they've needed me, just like all important relationships. Tonight, even though we find ourselves under stay-at-home orders, our clergy continue to lead, support, and minister to our congregation. And our congregation continues our outreach and support of our greater community. So even though our gala can be postponed, the need for funds raised cannot. Whether you planned on attending the gala or not, I am asking you for your support so that VOS can continue to fulfill its mission during these critical and unchartered times. Thank you so much for listening. The Wiccan family wishes you and your family health and comfort. Be well. Thank you. In January, I formed VOS's disaster and emergency response team. After the Woolsey fire, I'd recognized the need for a new kind of outreach, organized and trained VOS volunteer response to community-wide crisis. I remember hoping that we would never need to use it. That was in January. Before the end of the first week of Safer at Home in March, the team I trained had called every member of VOS, and days later, they called the non-members who join us for the High Holy Days, over 550 people in total. We were there with a steadying virtual hand. Our message was clear, VOS is here. This is what outreach means to show up for you, to support and inspire. This has been the VOS mission for more than 30 years, outreach. It's always been my calling to serve and support you, to be present with a calm and open heart, whether at your bedside or on your doorstep in a crisis, helping you or your family work through the confusion of life's most challenging moments. And now all of us at VOS are reaching through the airwaves of technology to continue to bring you inspiration, education, physical and emotional support during this time of isolation and concern. Rabbi and I are here for you. All of us at VOS are supporting you and those you love. I'm grateful to you for taking the time to listen to our message. It's heartfelt and it's urgent. We need your support so we can continue to support you, to celebrate with you, to inspire you, to counsel you, and to share life with you as we've done for more than three decades. We need each other. It's what we know, it's what we've learned. 
now more than ever, we need to be dependable to each other. So I ask you to be an instrument of our resilience. We can, we will move forward with strength and security. We'll do it together. VOS isn't a luxury. It's not something we cut from our lives or our budget without very real consequence to our souls, our families, and this beautiful community. How do the rabbis put it? Kol Yisrael arivim ze beze. All of Israel, the Jewish people, are responsible for each other. You and I are responsible for each other. We need to raise $125,000 in this spring gala campaign. I ask you to please use the link on the screen at the end of this message or the pledge card that was recently mailed to you to make as generous and strengthening a charitable donation to VOS as possible. Let's not let our Jewish life become a casualty of a virus. Thank you.